Run for Change was an idea that I had back in 2016 and I really wanted to start um, a movement that raises awareness on mental health and addictions because there isn't really any kind of run that focuses just on mental health and addiction so I really wanted to be the change of that so it's a movement to raise awareness on mental health and addictions and all the money that we do raise for the event gets donated back to our community for mental health initiatives. Run for Change is a 5k run or walk you can come as you are you don't even have to train for this you can just come out and be involved um, and what we do is we do a 5k route along the waterfront and it's really just an opportunity to come out and really embrace our community and be that support and we have an after party that follows so after our 5k route we come back we have some nutrition we have some prizes that we give out and then we're having an after party at the steam fitters lounge just to celebrate all the hard work that goes into putting this event on I'm really thankful that the machine shops donating our space so we're having the event again at Century 21 under the rink and yeah it's just a really great opportunity to come out and really experience what they're building here too. So if you really want to be involved but you're not a walker, you're not a runner and you'd like to still come out we would love to have you. We aren't able to have this event without our volunteers so if that's something that you're interested in we would love to have your, um, your support with that and there's donation opportunities so even if you don't want to come and run or walk it you can still donate um, that that way as well. All the money that we raise for the event stays locally here in Sault Ste. Marie. So in the past we have supported the YMCA, Algoma Family Services, Women in Crisis, um, we have donated to the Piper Project, Rainbow Camp. So we don't really pick an organization to donate all the funds to because we believe that there's many agencies and many families that can benefit from all the money that we raise. So throughout the year when we know that there's an agency that is needing funds, we will donate those funds to them. Or if there's a family that's in need, they can certainly call Strong Minds. And if we have the money to be able to support them, they are definitely supported through Strong Minds. So that means if they're waiting for a therapist and they don't have the money, uh, we will support them to uh, pay for therapy or even um, gym memberships. So a lot of times people can't afford gym memberships. So we will use that money that we raise to be able to provide a, that type of uh, support for families. So if you go on our website, www.strongminds.co, and you go under the tab Run for Change, all the information's there, what Run for Change is, how to uh, register, how to donate, even our pledge form is up now. Um, you can register there or you can go on Eventbrite and you can look up Run for Change and you can sign up that way as well. So there's a few different options. We also have a lot of information on our Instagram and we actually just have so much more involvement with the community this year is what I'm noticing. We have a lot of sponsorships, so it's really great to see our community recognizing how important this cause is.